And then the main event, Young Bucks and the Good Brothers versus the Lucha Brothers and Jurassic Express. And Don Callis did commentary. This match was great. I mean... Ray, Ray Phoenix is phenomenal. Not just Ray Phoenix, but when Ray Phoenix was in there with Nick Jackson... Oh, yeah. It was so awesome. Yeah, and they always, they, they, they're, 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 they're incredible together. But everybody was good. I mean, the, the, whole, the match itself was great, but... Yeah, I mean, um, and you know the people like the, the one spot where um, Ray Phoenix did like didn't he like do like triple jumps, and the place just they gave him a standing ovation in the middle of the match for one for one of his spots. So the interesting thing is that the Young Bucks hit the Meltzer driver on Phoenix, Ray Phoenix, yep. and pinned him, which yep. I was flabbergasted by because I figured that. You know, give the Lucha that, Brothers a win. That or the Lucha somebody. Brothers should that the Lucha Brothers should get a pin on on uh, Matt or Nick Jackson. Well, right? you could you could do that, but I mean, they rarely actually pin the champions. But the point is, it was an eight person, but so like could they could have pinned you, anybody in the match. But, but you could you could have done you could have done it. Sure, you could have done anything. But like the point is, they should have pinned somebody. They should have gotten the pin. Them getting pinned. I mean, I don't want to overthink this because you know the obvious thing would be well, they're going to beat the Young Bucks. Well, but this could be what? the deal where you're supposed to think that, and then the Young Bucks are going to beat them. But I will say, when you watch the show, the show ended with a wow. giant heel beatdown. They lower the cage. The heels destroy everybody. And I'm watching this show, and this is a heavy heel show. Kenny Omega is not beating Christian. I mean, the Lucha Brothers probably are going to win the tag you, you, titles you, on Sunday. Wait, wait. You you think that Kenny Omega is not beating Christian? I think Kenny no. Omega Kenny Omega is, is beating Christian. I'm sorry. I Christian is I, not beating Kenny Omega. I I I don't think Christian's beating Kenny Omega. No. But yes, when I watched this thing and the show was over, my conclusion was that you know what my conclusion was aside from the fact that that I think Pentagon and Fingers are going to win the championship. My other conclusion is is that. I remember this cage because it's the cage Cody jumped off of and nearly broke his leg jumping off of it. And Nick Jackson's in this match and Ray Phoenix is in this match. And God damn, that cage is so high. And you like, I don't want to say that these guys are going to jump off it because now like people, will, oh, wait, well, they got to do it now. But I was thinking like, it's Ray Phoenix. How's he not? It is. Jump? But you know what, Dave? It's also Nick Jackson who had that ladder match a couple of years ago, which was absolutely insane, and vowed that he would never do something like that again. Both of the Bucks did, right? They're not going to do that again. Well, well, the, so the I can't the... imagine that Nick Jackson's thinking, why don't we do a, a, a destroyer off the top of the cage? To They're the not going to do a destroyer off the top of the cage. I, I could imagine Phoenix doing some crazy dive onto three guys. I could see that happening. Like a cross? Well, I could see yeah. a cross. Yeah, I could see a cross. Or a tornado that... dive or something? Yeah, that cage is really high. I wish it wasn't so damn high because if it wasn't so high, we'd probably have like a lot of really, you know, maybe we would have a freaking Canadian destroyer off the top of a cage. I don't know, but but it's like that one's just just like it's a little bit it's a little bit high for a lot of the ideas. But um, you know, I mean, like as far as the tease when when the young bucks were in there with Pentagon and Phoenix, this was so good and. You know, I've seen, I've seen, I don't know how many Young Bucks, Pentagon, and Phoenix matches between AEW and AAA and, and PWG, which is actually the first ones that I saw. And my God, it's like some of the greatest tag team matches that I have ever seen. I mean, I mean, right up there with, you know, any, you know, with, with the, you know, the Misawa and Kobashi and Kawada and Tawe. I mean, it's very different. I mean, it's, it's not like they're different, but, but it's just as great, you know, and, 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 um, you know, I, I wouldn't say that I have seen them do a better match than the Young Bucks, Omega, and uh, Adam Page because, because, but I've seen them do do close. And that ladder match, that ladder match that they did two years ago was absolutely incredible. And you know, even if they never use the cage and they just use the top rope, it's like freaking Ray Phoenix and Nick Jackson. And then you know, again, I don't want to discount Matt Jackson and Pentagon because they're great too, but. Um, yeah, that that is going to be an interesting show because Omega and Christian have to top their TV match that was excellent. You've got these guys in the cage who are going to tear down the house, and then you got the CM Punk match, which is going to get an amazing reaction. 
But they did lose Andrade and Pac, which probably would have been a great match, too. So uh, there you go. Hey, if you're a big fan of Wrestling Observer Radio, we got 12,000 episodes of all of our podcasts up at our website, WrestlingObserver.com. If you sign up today, you get access to every single one of them. The 12 to 18 new shows that we do every single week. You can podcast them, listen to them on the road, at work, working out, in the shower, wherever you listen to your podcasts. And also full access to the Wrestling Observer newsletter and archives. So if you love what you hear, head to WrestlingObserver.com. 12,000 audio shows at your fingertips.